What it do, what it do, what it do, Half and Jay family. Welcome back to the channel, baby. Yes. It's your boy Half. And hey, your girl Jay. And we back with, with another, another reaction, reaction video. video. All right, y'all, welcome back to the channel. It's Music Monday. Uh, so, happy Monday, everybody out yes, there. Yes, happy Monday, y'all. You know what I mean? How you feeling? I'm feeling great. All this lint. I thought she was trying to slap me for a minute. But um, hope everybody enjoying their Monday. You feel me? Uh, we about to get into some more, some more reactions, man. You know what I'm saying? Jay's birthday was on Friday, so she said she had a good time. She said she had a blast. So that's a good thing. I get to live another day. Um, mm. <laughs> you get mm. to live another day? Mm. What does that mean? Uh, I get to live another day. But anyway, let them know who we're reacting to today. We're reacting to Hardy featuring Lainey Wilson, and the song is called Wait in the Truck. Wait in the Truck. That's what I be telling Jay to do. Just wait in the truck. Don't even get out. Just, just wait in the truck. Mm. Yeah, a lot of, lot to say. And I do too, though. I'll, I'll say it in the next video. All right, well, anyway, let's get into it. But before we do, everybody that's out there who has not yet subscribed to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Yes. Turn your phone notifications on. Yes. Like and share this video. Yes. And comment down below, BB. Down below. Come and join the squad, Come man, on. Half and Jay. Come on. We over here kicking off. What? Yeah. Good, Good vibes, vibes, baby. Good, Good vibes. vibes. Boom. Boom. All right, let's see what Hardy and Lainey Wilson talking about. See why he said wait in the truck. June thunderstorm? Where is he at in June? June is like, that's like summertime, isn't it? Or damn near summertime, right? Where we're from. Yeah. yeah I, mean. I love his voice. Yeah. Dope. Before working my way through a middle of June in a thunderstorm, there was something in the headlights that stopped me. This is just somebody that's driving down the street and just see a random person in, on, in a row, mm -hmm. bruised up, and decides to go uh, to, help. to help take care of business, huh? I love their voices. Yeah. She came off really good, though. She definitely complimented. Both of them. Yeah, oh, like, yeah absolutely. It sounds so good. Absolutely. They, they mesh together mm -hmm. really well. Mm -hmm. I'm from a judge under a sea. Well, I knocked and knocked and no one came, so I kicked 
True gangster though. <laughs> he came up in there and kicked the dough in like it was a raid. You feel me? Like he had like a thousand SWAT teams with him. <laughs> Bam! Took my man down. Boom! Uh, yeah, I gave him one. Went outside and smoked a cigarette. I wonder if he smoked one of his cigarettes. <laughs> I'm just saying. He, I mean, you know, you know, you know. Damn. This is a pretty deep uh little 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 story oh, though. Yeah. I wonder if something like this ever really happened, though. Like, just a random guy just seen, like, you know what I'm saying? And just decided to go, you know, do something like that, though. That would be crazy. It would. That would, would be really crazy. You would think maybe that the guy was already going through something himself. It was just like, that was just the end of it right there. Like, Okay, I have a lot of... I, if I wrote a book about my life, right. I dealt with someone who was abusive mm -hmm. and he beat me in front he beat me at a park mm -hmm. he beat me at a park and I had my newborn daughter with me you guys and I had to I had her in a car seat and I had to run with her with the car seat and he was I had to sit her down mm -hmm. and he 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 didn't even he didn't care that I had right. our daughter right. with us right and um, I had to leave her. <laughs> I was, I prayed. I was praying, praying, praying. I left her on a corner, mm -hmm. a street corner. A couple was watching the whole time. Mm -hmm. And thank God that they were good people. Mm -hmm. They picked my daughter up for me. Right. And they saw me running and they saw him chasing after me. Right. And they told me to come on and get in the car. Yeah. And they took me to safety. But... It, it, it's just a trip, you know. People will yeah. intervene. At right, right, time. right. Absolutely, absolutely, mm -hmm. absolutely. You know, and that's good that you have people like that. Mm -hmm. You know, because I know there was a case. It turned out the wrong way, but it was a case. Somebody was walking down the street with him and his girl. They was getting into it. Mm -hmm. You know, what I'm saying he was physically, you know, beating her up and hitting her and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Neighbors seen it. He came down, intervened, telling him like, "Yeah, that's not cool." To why bam, dude shot him and killed him. Mm. You know what I mean? So a lot of times it's not safe. It's not. It's not it's safe not. to to help you know, out because but, you have people who are really, really crazy and right, deranged. Right, right. So you gotta kinda like pick and choose your battles, I guess you can say. You know what I mean? Right. But it's just the the natural instinct to help to help someone. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, you know, and then unfortunately that man lost his life doing that, but um, you know, it's just, it's just a sad thing, though, man. It's just a sad thing.
it's a whole hell of a lot better than the place I sent him to. Thank you. to you like that, huh? Because I've been abused more than once. Right. And it just feels, I mean, I don't condone. I wouldn't want to see nobody die. Right. But it's just I feel it's a cowardly act mm -hmm. to hit and abuse a woman because mm -hmm. a woman is not as strong as a man. Right. And for a man to physically abuse a woman, like <laughs> it hurts. Right. It hurts a lot. Like, it really hurts. And just to see that she got her victory and, you know, someone, a stranger helped her. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, he, he's got locked up, but, you know, someone cared about her enough to to end her pain. Right. This song, I, I really love this video and I love this song. Like, this is something I would definitely put on my playlist and mm -hmm. watch this I will watch this video over and out. Right. Yeah. Right. This is really, yeah. It's a, it's definitely a, uh, especially like you said, when you when you went through something like that, mm -hmm. it, it definitely touches you in a different type of way. So, you know, and um, like I said, for him to even go out his way to risk his own freedom. Right. You know what I'm saying? For a woman that he don't even know. Right. Goes to show how much he believes in doing the right thing. I'm not saying that that was the right thing to do as far as going to kill the man, but um, you know what I mean? But right. he felt like he had to come he to her protect, aid. Yeah, yeah, he, he protected like he her. He to kept her, her safe. And right. Like I said, I don't condone killing. Right, 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 right. But she's not going to experience that anymore. Exactly. And Especially by that man. By that, yeah. Right. Right. That was a touching Ooh. one. That was a touching one. I wonder if, uh, you know, could I you continue on with stories and stuff like that? I wonder if he would have regrets somewhere down the line or, you know, will they get married while he's in jail? You know what I'm saying? Maybe doing a life sentence if, if that's the outcome. You know what I mean? Like, right. what would be the continuance of that, right. of that story? You know, that's, that's, the, that's where your imagination you know, kind of comes into play and you kind of uh, play it out how you would imagine that would play out, you know? So, um, very touchy song, as y'all see. Um, definitely for Jay, because she, uh, she has went through things like, that. well, not exactly like that, but she just told the story. So, um, you know, I'm sure a lot of women out there probably felt that song as well, you know, has went through something like that similar or maybe if not the same, you know? Um, comment down below. Let us know what you think about that song. Uh, how did it touch you when you first heard it? Or, um, you know, if you ever been in that kind of a situation, not exactly like that, but something. An abusive relationship. Right, an abusive relationship type of thing. And if you are watching this video and you are, it's still, ex are you, if you're experiencing an abusive relationship, 
get out. Mm -hmm. Get out of it. It's not going to get better. He's not going to change. Mm -hmm. It's always going to be the same. He will butter you up and tell you the good things to reel you back in. Mm -hmm. But baby girl, he's not going to change. It's only going to get worse. And just take take heed to what I'm saying to you. Right. Like, just get out because it's, it, it will do no good, especially if you have children together. Right. That will affect not only you, but them too. Like, right. get out. Get out. And I know sometimes it may be easier said than done. It you is. You know what I mean? It's but, easier said than done. Um, just, just, whatever that's going to be that motivation for you to leave or, you know what I mean, for you to make that change, focus on that. You know what I mean? Focus on that. Um, you know, for a man to keep hitting on to a hood and a woman like that, that's 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 not love. You know what I mean? So Right. And it it was times he would just randomly hit me out of the blue because he was so miserable with himself. Mm -hmm. I, I didn't have to say anything at all and he would just hit me. Right. And Yeah, that's major insecurities yeah. and uh, he like was said, very he insecure yeah. and a lot all of his friends you know they 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 weren't with it right so a lot of people turned on him right. when they would see he would he would do it and he would hit me in front of his friends right he thinking, would hit me anywhere that he gonna get cool points for that right you know what I'm saying? and a lot of people no. were against it a lot right. of people told me like jamie you need to leave him alone right like i didn't know he was like that right. i had no clue right but if you if you are experiencing this this get help get out yes. because I'm telling you it only gets worse. I I was I'm thankful that I have the family that I have. My family helped me get away from this guy. Mm -hmm. Like they really helped me. Um you need a support system. You really do. You need a good support system. And I know it's hard because you love him so hard so you think it's not love. If a person is hitting you like that, that's not love. You need to leave it alone and just figure it out on your own and do what's best for you. All right. Yeah. So, all right. So, hope y'all enjoyed it. And uh, hope you guys stuck with us to the end so y'all can hear your names, baby. Let's yes. get you some shout outs. Okay. First shout out goes to Jake Borsch. What's up, Jake Borsch? Jake Borsch, shout out to you, man. Hope you definitely enjoyed that reaction. Uh, let us know what you thought about it. Comment down below. Yes. And I'll come back and join us for some more reactions. Yes. And second shout out goes to I Am The Pope. What's up, I Am The Pope? I Am The Pope. What's going on? Shout out to you. Hope you definitely enjoyed that reaction. Let us yes. know what you thought about it. Mm -hmm. I'll leave your comments down below. Yes. We want to thank everybody for uh, always stopping by. You yes. know what I'm saying? Yes. Thank you so, so much, right. you guys. I mean, y'all stopped by a lot, so we definitely appreciate that. Mm -hmm. um, no need for knocking, ringing the doorbell. Y'all can just come on in. Always. You know they always, always welcome. Always welcome. Come on in. You ain't even got to take your shoes off. We tell everybody else they got to take, take their the shoes, shoes off. Y'all can come on in with your shoes on. Mm -hmm. Just don't have no dog poop on it. Just don't have no dog poop on it. Because Jay going to get mad. I'm telling you. She don't play that. Does she? <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. So, look. Make sure y'all go out y'all way. To have yourself a marvelous day. Marvelous day. And we'll catch you guys in the next reaction video. Yes. Peace. Peace.